Hello, my name is Steven Anderson, and I would like to welcome you to Appalachian ATV Adventures. Growing up in Southern West Virginia, trail riding was an everyday event. And after traveling the world, working as a golf teaching professional for a number of years, I realized telling stories about the trail back home that the secret to West Virginia was the mountains. At Appalachian ATV Adventures, we want to unlock those secrets and take you along for the ride. ATVs are quickly becoming the number one outdoor activity. It's a sport the whole family can enjoy all year round. West Virginia is the number two destination for ATV riders in the U.S. And the heart of it all is the Hatfield and McCoy trail system. Well, hey guys, we're down at the office of Jeff Lusk, uh, the executive director of the Hatfield McCoy Trail System. Uh, Jeff and I actually graduated uh, school together over the hill in a little town called Oceana. We grew up riding these trails before the uh, Hatfield McCoy Trail System actually came about. Uh, so, Jeff, why don't you tell us a little bit about the trail system and uh, what you got going on? Well, you know, that's an exciting time. And as you said, we grew up riding these trails. And the great thing about the Hatfield McCoy Trail System is the trails we grew up riding, now folks from all over this country can come and enjoy. And uh, this past year, we had 50 states uh, that visited the trail system. And the great thing, we've had nine foreign countries. So hard to believe something me and you grew up riding. There are folks from nine foreign countries thought it was so appealing they came here to ride the same uh, it's trails. It's so exciting. I mean, I can't believe what you guys have done in just eight to ten years of uh, service. It, it blows my mind. Uh, it is. You know, we're one of the fastest growing tourist attractions in West Virginia. I was showing you on the computer earlier, our permit sales are up 40 percent this year, mm -hmm. which is exciting for the trail system. And what we're seeing now is a lot of families coming here. We're seeing a lot of women uh, enjoying their men and come here and visit the trail system. Uh, this year we're hoping to kick off a new marketing plan to educate folks all over this country about the trail system and I think that's the key. We've got one of the best kept secrets here in southern West Virginia and I think it's just going to keep growing. What well, is, and you know, here in the Appalachian Mountains you just can't beat it. I mean, we have uh, four seasons, which is great. Uh, you've been out, we can ride in the snow, we can ride in the spring and the greenery, we can ride in the summer, or in the fall when we have the foliage, which is, is probably the most popular time here in West Virginia. And we're open 365 days a year? Uh, 365 days a year. We, we never close. We're just like the highway. If you come here, there'll be a place for you to ride. That's right. You know what they say, folks, West Virginia is almost heaven. So, uh, Jeff, I appreciate you letting us come by and talk to you. I'm sure we'll see you again, hopefully, out on the trail here sh shortly. And uh, uh, We need to get together and ride again. Well, you know, we have a great time. And you mentioned West Virginia is almost heaven. We like to consider Hatfield McCoy's trails as trails heaven. Trails heaven, that's right. Well, listen, folks, we've enjoyed talking to Jeff here. and We're going to get back out on the trail, and uh, we'll talk to you later. Welcome to On the Trail. I'm your host, Stephen Anderson. And this week, we're in Gilbert, West Virginia, for the 2008 Annual Trail Fest. This fall event usually attracts at least 1,500 riders. The city of Gilbert is great because it's ATV friendly. You can ride your four-wheeler or your dirt bike down to McDonald's to the supermarket to get some last minute supplies. It's just awesome to be able to do that. The other great thing about the Trail Fest is the Harless Center. Next door to that, you have the Mud Pit. The Mud Pit's got a thousand people around it every night, screaming, going crazy, rooting on their buddies, seeing if he can get through the mud. Beside that, you've got a drag strip where buddies are out there uh, fighting to see who's four-wheeler's faster. It's real exciting. The other great thing about this year at the Trail Fest that I just heard about is a wedding. Two people are actually getting married on their four-wheelers on top of the mountain up here at one of the uh, hilltop resorts. This is a 1500 rider event. It's a great event. It's right here in southern West Virginia and it's an all-inclusive package. The great thing about this is if you contact the Hatfield McCoy Authority early enough and stay right here beside the Larry Joe Harless Center, they feed you in the morning, they feed you at lunch, and they feed you dinner. All this entertainment's right here next door. All the big names, Suzuki, Kawasaki, Yamaha, they've all got their trucks out here. They've got, got demo rides going on. They've got a demo track. I mean, this is one heck of an event. It lasts about three days right here in Southern West Virginia. We're gonna show you some clips and we'll get back to you. You know folks, ATVing could be a little intimidating for some, 
But with the proper gear and the proper training, everybody can enjoy it. ATV has turned into a culture in itself that the whole family can enjoy. So I hope to see you out on the trail.